Hi, this is Joachim for statisticsglob.com and in this video I will show you how to add Greek symbols to a ggplot2 plot in the R programming language. So in the video I'm going to show you two examples and both of these examples are based on the data frame that we can create with lines 2 and 3 of the code. So if you run these lines of code you will see that at the top right of RStudio a new data frame object appears. And furthermore, if we want to plot these data with a ggplot2 package, we also need to install and load the ggplot2 package, as you can see in lines 5 and 6 of the code. I have installed the package already, so I'm just going to load it with line 6 of the code. And now we are able to use the functions of the ggplot2 package. Now, if we want to draw a basic ggplot2 scatterplot, then we can apply the code that you can see in lines 8 and 9. So if you run these lines of code, you will see that at the top right of our studio a new plot object appears. And we can also draw this plot to the RStudio console by running line 10 of the code. And then you will see that at the bottom right of our studio a new plot appears. Now let's assume that we want to add a title to this plot which contains Greek letters. Then we can apply the code that you can see in lines 12 and 13. So in these lines of code, I'm first using my previously created plot object as basement. And then I'm adding to this plot object the gg title function. And within the gg title function, I'm using the expression function. And then within the expression function, I'm specifying my title and the Greek letters that I want to use. So here in this example, you can see that I want to draw the alpha and beta symbols to my main title. So if you run lines 12 and 13 of the code, you will see that at the bottom right of our studio, our plot is updated. And as you can see, we have just added a title to our plot, which is saying Greek title alpha beta. So in the first example, you have learned how to add Greek alphabet letters to a main title of a ggplot2 plot. However, it is also possible to add Greek letters within the plot. And this is what I'm showing you in lines 15 to 17 of the code. So in these lines of code, I'm again first using the plot object that I have created before as basement. And then I'm adding to this plot object the annotate function. And within the annotate function, I'm specifying that I want to annotate text. I'm specifying the X and Y positions where I want to add this text. And then I'm adding the label argument, which is specifying the text that I want to add. And then again, I'm using the expression function as I did in the previous example. But this time I'm using the text Greek text instead of Greek title. So if you run these lines of code, you will see that our plot is updated again. And this time our text is shown within the plot. So in this video, you have learned how to add Greek symbols to a main title or within the plot area of a ggplot2 plot. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on the homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you could check it out there. And furthermore, if you have liked the video, I would be very happy if you leave me thumbs up on the video or if you leave me a positive comment. And make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel in order to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new R programming tutorials to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time.